It rained. Welcome to Blog Oklahoma. In May 2015, something really surprising happened here in our small western Oklahoma town. It rained. That in itself would be amazing after the long drought we've had, but when I say it rained, I mean it rained. Now, I lived here in western Oklahoma for most of my adult life, and this was the most rain I've ever seen fall in a single afternoon. Here in my town alone, creeks burst their banks, Vehicles were drowned, homes in f were flooded, roads and bridges were washed away, and unfortunately, many other Oklahoma communities experienced the same rain and flooding. I wish all my friends and neighbors affected by this a speedy cleanup and recovery. Luckily for us, we live up on a hill, but we still had a little more than ankle-deep water in our backyard. I mean, our entire backyard was covered in water. Water was rapidly moving from one side of our house through the backyard and down our driveway. So much sediment was moved from our backyard, we now have a sandbar built up at the end of our drive. Now that was some rain. That was some amazing drought-busting rain. So even with all the bad, you know, the flooding and everything, something good happened. The earth is no longer parched. Now here's something kind of amazing. We got our lake back. On the south side of our town is a small city park and lake. For the last few years, that lake had dried up until it was nothing but a small pond. Its boat ramps led to dry ground. There's a fishing dock there that was actually sitting on the ground, dry, several yards from even the slightest moisture. You could walk from one side of the lake to the other without even getting muddy, and sagebrush had started to grow in the once water-filled channels. If it hadn't been for the city park surrounding the lake, you would not even known there was a lake there. It looked like you just wandered onto some rancher's land and you would expect to see a herd of cattle grazing on the dry prairie grass, slowly making their way to the small watershed. And just days before that drenching rain, that lake looked exactly as I described, dry. We got so much rain in that one afternoon, the entire lake has filled back up to overflowing. Now, just prior to recording this, I drove back down to the lake to check on things. Happy to say, it's still full of water, and it's back to its pre-drought levels. Its waters are clearing up and no longer a deep, opaque dirt red. The plant life surrounding the lake is a deep green, and there were families picnicking. And there were actually people out there fishing. I don't know what they'll catch, but they were doing it. Our lakeside city park has sprung back to life. So here's your writing suggestion for this episode. What were your experiences with this rain? Has your community recovered from the flooding and drought? I look forward to reading all about it. Just a little reminder, with all this epic rain will come an epic amount of mosquitoes. Oklahoma health officials have already posted warnings about the West Nile virus that can be transmitted by mosquitoes. If you haven't yet, please walk around your yard and check for any standing water. You have likely already have mosquito larvae swimming around in it. So, use that, take that water and dump it or treat it. <laughs> Get rid of those mosquitoes. In this episode's bonus links, I'll be sharing some photos and videos of the uh, rainstorm, along with some other fun things, so please check out the show notes. Oh, and a little Blog Oklahoma update. I've swapped out the audio player on the podcast pages, so it should uh, simplify listening to the podcast from the website. I'm happy to announce, as of June 7th, 2015, Blog Oklahoma has 881 registered Oklahoma bloggers. Hooray! Your feedback is important, so please feel free to contact me with your comments or questions. You can get hold of me in a multitude of ways. Just visit blogoklahoma.net slash contact 
for more information. Check our show notes for all the links and bonus material from today's episode. This has been Kevin Latham for Blog Oklahoma. Until next time. Thank <laughs> you.